Hi everyone, welcome back to Dashboard. My name is Justin and in this video we're gonna talk about the brand new update that just came out and that is the ability for you to have a custom watch list. I know you've been wanting this for the longest time and it is finally here. A custom watch list is the ability for you to have an at a glance view of all of the asset classes you wanna analyze at a moment's notice. One of the Also, one of the newest updates within Dashboard is the ability for you to analyze pretty much any stock you want. Now, at the moment, you can only analyze, I'd say, about 70 to 80% of the stocks that are supported on Robinhood. If you don't know what Robinhood is, that is basically one of the most popular U.S.-based brokerages. Uh, you guys know the whole fiasco with Robinhood. But besides that, you can, you can pretty much analyze most of the stocks that are supported within Robinhood for the time being. Also, if you want to see a full list of the stocks that will be supported and are supported right now, visit marketmakersmethod.com and eventually in the near future, there will be a full list on that website. So stay tuned for updates regarding that list. But let me show you here how to manage your watch list and add and remove pairs from your watch list. It's actually very simple. You go over here to the left side and you click on watch list. And as you can see, here are all the things that I currently have on my watch list. These are actually not all of them, but let me show you how to remove them. So let's say, for example, right now I have Apple. Let's say I no longer want to analyze Apple. All I do is I go to watch list and right here where it says Apple, I click the X. And as you can see, it removed Apple from my watch list. If I want to add it back, I click watch list and I just click the plus sign. That's it. Now let me go ahead and remove a lot of these. Let's remove Facebook. Let's remove Amazon. Let's remove Nvidia. Google, Zynga, PayPal. Let's say you only want to have Forex pairs. Then what you do is you just remove everything. Let's go ahead and remove everything just to make it a lot easier. And then let's start adding Forex pairs. Let's start with the USD pairs. I click that. And as you can see, it automatically shows all of the USD Forex pairs at a glance. It also includes the US 30 pair. Now, of course, it's not a Forex pair, but you get what I'm saying. Anything that starts with USD, it's going to be right here. So let's say well, I'm going to start adding GBPUSD, EURUSD, USD CAD, USD MXN, CHF, JPY, and let's just go down the list, right? So that's all the Forex pairs uh, based on USD pairs. Now let's add more. Let's go ahead and click on GBP pairs. Let's add GBP AUD, CAD, and you get my point. So whatever you want to have, if you're a stock trader, you can add just stocks. If you're a Forex trader, you can add just Forex pairs. If you only trade cryptos, you can add cryptos. You just, all you have to do is you go over here to watch list and you search that crypto. So let's search XRP USD. And as you can see, Ripple is right there and you add that. And if you want to remove one, don't forget, you just click the X. That is how you use the watch list. That is how you add and remove pairs. It's very simple and we hope you enjoyed the update. Once again, if you have any questions, we have customer support here at the bottom right. You click that live chat and you can speak with the customer representative live. That's it. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.